So to continue, we can make uh, uh, some additional blotting according to the needs. So you can uh, make more on this side, for example, um, or on, on this side. From the distance, I want to bring this to paint something on, on this side to, to make this mm. another peak, maybe the clouds in be between. So I might make it a little bit on this. It's good. Yeah. Okay. So uh, what I do is I will put it on paper facing down so I'll paint exactly what I want. I can still see the picture. Right? Mm -hmm. So I would use a brush and some uh, ink, some green color maybe. <laughs> Very dry. I want it very soft. So just block it like that. Okay. And uh, maybe a little more. Dry into the mist. And I need to go back to see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. To Take a look, and that tell me where where to add more. Um, we can add something in between. Uh, let's see. So this is the peak. This is maybe the foreground. We can do something dark. So that's uh, another mm -hmm. thing. If you view from bird's eye, there's no middle ground. No. So all the I mean, there's no foregrounds. Everything is middle ground. So we don't want to do the to do that. As long as the picture completes, we'll be fine. And you can also uh, just paint directly, but be careful. So I will paint maybe on on the back, you know, just to give it a hint like that. Mm -hmm. For the, yeah, sometimes I see the shadow of the crinkled mm -hmm. paper and give me some hint. Uh, okay. So if it because the painting is on the back side, it's the more uh, subdued, not to to this to to be too strong. So you can you can paint it on the other side, but not to paint exactly the same height. Right? You can go either up or lower, maybe lower to complete that a little bit. So I'm going to. That's good. Um, good. Okay. Try to do it uh, without uh, leaving too much um, main, you know, like traditional brush strokes. Try to do it in a natural approach. I see some subtle, like a, this is like a cut of uh, the road. Uh, so you can go up, behind, and the top. And we normally don't do the the sky in, in uh, color, uh, but you can see in uh, some paintings I do to do them according to the situation because the sky is outside the picture. Um, the horizon is in the from bird's eye view. It's outside the picture. You're painting like a Google map or yeah. Google Earth. Yeah, yeah, Google yeah, yeah, Earth. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's basically like a Google Earth uh, view. Yeah. Okay, uh, so you can write a poem, you know, with uh, some uh, universal uh, landscape kind of. Okay, so. 
So it takes a long time, just go, go back, appreciate, and then, you know, do some more. Here, a little peak. Maybe. Yes. <coughs> Can I lose it? No more. No, no, no. It's really done. It's uh, finished? Seventy percent, not yet, huh? Fifty percent. Yeah, I think lots I, more. Yeah, I think that one that you just did needs to be have the same value as the ones that are around it, not oh. so light. Uh -huh. This this may be too green. Okay. That's uh, another thing we can we can mute it down. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. But that will be. Yeah, that's where you sort of look. I uh, try to re uh, reduce the intensity of the yeah, greens yes. to make it uh, more blended into the mountains, not just as on the surface. Yeah. So this is more like uh, you do the wash, the color first, and then you give the texture and uh, definition. Greens should be on top of black. That's why I do it under painting rather than painting directly. That's why I feel uh, yeah, it black covers ink, now it covers black. It gives a different uh, rich tone, not just the pure black, I mean pure ink, but green. It's no good. So green and, and black. Ah, I thought you wanted that. <laughs> no, 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 she no. wants the dog. No. <laughs> I don't have souvenir. Mm -hmm. Happy. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, I think that's uh, it. Yeah. That brings back to the. May we put the green down to. Oh, a little more to the fans. No, 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 no. The yeah. green. Green? Yes. Here, no? Where? To record this green. Maybe something. Oh. No. No, because no, you've got that bright Most green right on the left of that mountain down. This one. Yeah, 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 you've got that. So that just goes good, blink, blink, and it's all done. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm. A little shading on the top, I'll just leave it there, that's no, okay, leave, yeah. leave it. Now, oh, you got to be a remote layer or something. To make the white really white, we need to use the pouring black <laughs> to define yeah, the sky. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, why not? Yeah, yeah, okay. We're pulling black. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like a black wash on top, make it mm -hmm. dark. But that would be very risky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I, I can show you a picture I've done similar Unless to this. You, yeah. Can you mask 
in, were on the space. Oh, but that's no problem for for controlling the the ship, the skyline. I have uh, no problem on that. Just it will change the perspective. So now you're looking up. You're yeah, looking yeah, up. Yeah. yeah. I think that that make it more majestic. Kind of. I I think that would make it really majestic. Yeah. yeah. Um, we can also do just random. Yeah, uh, I, I always saw it as sweeping it. strokes. You know, just something in the in the sky with the moon. <laughs> that's uh, that's what I think. Should I do a moon in the sky? I always saw this painting as uh, seen from below, seeing the mountains. Yeah, up. yeah, that's what the normal. No, but that's how I see this one. You still see that one? This yes, okay, I understand then, that you're doing something different. Okay, okay. then uh, we just follow the convention of a uh, uh, view of a uh, uh, majestic mountain seen from the bottom up. So I'm going to do that in the um, big brush. So we need to uh, use Allen to save the, the moon. Yeah, this is Alan. Mm -hmm. Alan solution. It's a four. You you make an Alan very four when you do uh, snow or you know, mm -hmm. uh, as a uh, as a resist, uh, which means you use it like hot water to dissolve it. The Alan Alan treatment should, uh, need to be. Uh, we will call it a four solution, uh, you know, like a uh, four consistency. So you dissolve it until it no longer dissolves. That kind of very thick, but you don't feel the, the the thickness. Is this good for the moon here? Yeah. Oh. There, there. Oh, oh. Yes. Now. Yes. Yes. Now. Here? Yes. Done. Here. Yeah. I have to let it dry. Oh, because this is the resist, isn't it? Resist, yeah. This is the alum, this water resist. It's very easy, just uh, melt it in hot water. Actually, um, if you don't wait a complete dry, you will create a more soft, um, soft margin, which is maybe good for this style. If you if you wait it completely dry, the, sh the edge will be sharp, too sharp maybe. So I don't have to wait it dry to do it. Because I've already taken the, the, some, even if you use water, it will create some resistance. Because it's already, it will create a difference between this and the, 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 if I just wash over it, it will leave some water mark. But in, in this paper, this is different. The mulberry paper is already like semi size. So that difference is very small. If on absorbent paper, the unsized paper, even you drop some water first, paint a moon, and then you paint the sky, you will still still be like a lighter than the than the sky. Okay. So, what do you think about the mood? Do you see this uh, supposed to be? If I paint it with a wind like this. Down mm -hmm. or um, up, you know, or just the horizontal, very tranquil, peaceful kind of sky. What do you think? With the wind, right? More dramatic? Up. Up. Okay. Yeah, because the colors are very. Colors. Yeah. Let me use the hair dryer. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Dry fast. So I use it. make it dry. Yeah, I ch I'm thinking since we got the hair low, uh, hair dryer, maybe I just do more uh, amber to save the snow, when, so I can do a sweeping wash. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. Yes. Um, okay. Now I, I decide to do something uh, more interesting. So we can save some of the snows uh, with a 
on uh, Allen, so you don't have to trace all the shape. Mm -hmm. What I do is just to create some. Uh, I want this to be white. This pen to is Allen. I wanted this waterfall to be white, mm. basically. Mm. So when I wash this painting, I want to destroy that. Just make the color white there. You don't see that until I put the colors on. I don't wait anymore, just try to do it with the black to define the skyline so make it quite black especially the moon I don't want to really circle it, but uh, mm. <laughs> this paper is not very sensitive to our element because it's already sized. If it's unsized, when you make a size on it, it will be more dramatic. Finger <laughs> has to be used sometimes. I touched the, <laughs> the, <laughs> the, 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 the waterfall. See that Alan is not uh, working on this uh, same size paper. I should have used different paper if I used the Alan. If the moon doesn't come out, you can use white, but that's the last, last uh, uh, option I will use. I do can have. You, yes. Can you dry it with uh, some paper to remove the black of the? Uh, uh, the yeah, moon? you you can. Um, or with a sponge. Uh huh. With uh, just uh, tissue. Yes. Uh -huh. tissue. Exactly. Oh, you mean this waterfall part? As well, yes. The waterfall part, I use uh, this. Uh, it's called a uh, bleed proof uh, white. Dr. Dr. Martins. Do you know this? It's too strong. Okay, I got this from uh, a tip from uh, uh, Shay. Yeah. She used that too often, but she used a little bit too much. Mm -hmm. of, uh, yeah. Maybe yeah. I can use no, it on the on the back instead of. Shay. Yeah. 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 Ye
You see? Yeah. The white. The white of the water color. Yeah, on, on the on the back. Yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> they get excited. Yeah, because yeah, it's just like the highlight now. Yeah. Yes. So, should I do the moon with this this yeah, white? I yeah. think so. The moon has yeah. to be round and on, on the back. On the back. Yeah. On the back. It's a little too far from the edge. Too, too much from the top. Proof correct. 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 Proof more down the bottom of the room. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Lisha has uh, suggested me to entitle this painting as a uh, shining mountain top under moonlight. Uh, I translated uh, that idea into uh, four words in Chinese: silver moon. Jade Mountain, or Jade Moon, Silver Moon. Let's find a spot to sign. Uh, we can sign it on the upper right corner and put a seal on the lower left corner. Or we can just sign on the lower left corner and put a seal on the top. I think I'm going to do the second option. I think I have to write the moon on top because I write it uh, too big. So, moon on top. This says jade, jade peaks, jade peak. It says silver moon, jade peak. I'm going to write the date. Tonight is the full moon night of 